Hello, my name is Leo. Welcome back. Last time, we were on our way to the Dronkar Castle, and here we are. I'm impressed you could find a moth priest so quickly. So, quick heads up, uh, in case you forget where we are, I almost did. Uh, I'm currently on the Prophet uh, quest, which is finding the moth priest, and there it is. So, let's have a talk to Ishran. Hello. I'm impressed you could find a moth priest so quickly. Well, I do what I can, you bald bearded man. Does he have the Elder Scroll? Is everything ready? For the reading? Yeah. Just let the old man know when you're ready. And? Ah, hello there. Hey, Duxian. What's up? What can I do for you? You're a bald bearded man, too. Some sort of a bald bearded convention. Yeah. Glad you met here safely, Duxian. Ah, my rescuer. It's good to see you again. Have my companions made you feel welcome? It's not exactly the hospitality I'm used to, but your man Isran has seen to my needs well enough. And might I add, this is a remarkable fortress. I have colleagues back home that would love to study this place in detail. Are you prepared to read the Elder Scroll? Oh, most certainly. Let's find out what secrets the scroll can tell. Let's do that. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the night's children, a dread lord will rise in an age of strife. When dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. I must rest now. The reading has made me weary. Come on, man. You should get some rest. Do you have any insights about your Elder Scrolls reading? I wish I could say that I did. But without the other two scrolls, the picture will remain incomplete. I admit, I feel a bit frustrated that I can't be more helpful. Still, our enemy is likely just as much in the dark as we are, and that's something. Now it's a race to claim the remaining scrolls, and discover what part Oriel's bow has to play in this prophecy. I need the Elder Scroll that speaks of dragons. I wish I could help. The scrolls have changed hands so many times, it's impossible to keep track. Normally, I'd send you to the Imperial City in Cyrodiil to seek answers at the Imperial Library, but that avenue no longer exists. Why is that, Duxin? The Elder Scrolls vanished from the Imperial City around 175 of this era, and have been scattered across Tamriel by forces unknown. If you want to find the remaining scroll, you'll have to consult with someone versed in magical knowledge. Perhaps at the College of Winterhold? You're getting along with Isran. He takes some getting used to. 
I'm back from White River Watch with Drama Exploding Shark Ball Schematics. Back already? Can't wait. Let's see. Ooh, this diagram explains how to fashion a bolt that will send a jolt of shock through whatever it hits. Testing this will require some extra precautions, I think. Here, let me show you how it's made. Assuming you have the smithing skills, you should be able to make this yourself at Gunmar's Forge. Either way, I'll have some for sale soon. What can I do to help? I'm starting to think you like this as much as I do. Here's the location of the next set of Dwemer diagrams. Thanks. All right, then. Cozy little place, isn't this? This is everything I've got right now. Okay. I've destroyed the Master Vampire of Elbashad Mine. For those who cherish memories of loved ones, their compassion often conceals the beast. Our compassion compels us to destroy it. What can I do to help? Speak with Florentius. He has something for you. Take care. Hey, Florentius. Arke's been watching over me for years now. He says he's not too sure about you yet, though. Oh, uh, that's nice. Potions, my friend. Potions. Possibly some spells. Maybe some other things I've forgotten about. Actually, I'm not sure. Let's see, shall we? What can I do to help? Arke has some grave news, friend. Oh no. Your friend! Kidnapped! Who? A vicious night stalker rules over a group of bandits. Seeks to gain leverage over the righteous. Arke is never clear on life and death. Is she still alive? There's always hope. Who's Edda? Is that the danger chick? Is that the danger cannibal chick? Friends like you are hard to find, and very valuable to me. Well, let me I need your help. Looks like you've already got someone with you. Oh. Never mind then. Is that it? Kill the last vampire. Uh, 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 oh my god, how many? Dex is reading of the Elder Scrolls given more questions than answers. The mouth priest saw a vision of a weapon called Oriel's Bow about Serena. And I need to locate two more Elder Scrolls in order. Fully unusual. We may love the rest of the Raymi. Hey, you. Do you have a moment to talk? It's on your mind. That moth priest, Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. I think I know where we can start looking. Why didn't you say anything earlier? Half the people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. That doesn't exactly make me want to open up. I got a warmer welcome from my father. That's saying something. What is it between you two? Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. Uh, so where is this Elder... where is this Elder Scroll?
We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. We need to find my... She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. You said you didn't know where she went. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Alright, uh... Sounds like she was just following me cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Alright. Um, hiding with the Dawn God? They'd be even less welcoming to her than they've been to me. It would have been a bloodbath. And since the Dawn Guard are still around, that must not have happened. Any other ideas? Uh, sealed away like you were? I don't think so. She said she wanted to stay awake in case the situation was resolved. It had to be one of us, and, well, she's so much more powerful than I am. It just made sense for her to be out here. Anything else? Mm, in Castle Vercaria? Wait, that almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Isn't that pretty risky, staying around the castle? Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. They aren't going to let us through the front door. True, but I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Okay, well let's go to the castle secret entrance. Well, I don't take just anyone into the secret parts of the place I grew up. Get rid of this interloper and you and I can be on our way. I'll wait for you at the dock. Get rid of this interloper. I'll get rid of him. No, you won't. Well, I think this, uh, this episode's going on a bit too long. Mind you, I... I'm really sleepy and I think I sort of nodded off a couple of times there. Hope you're getting along. Here's everything I have. Sorry there isn't more. Well, you should be sorry. Until next time. Cozy little. It's no war maidens, but I've got a decent supply. Nice healthy supply of bolts. Divine smile on you, friend. Need some firewood.
Alright, well, like I said, I think this episode's gone on far too long, so... Please give my video a like if you enjoyed it, and uh, don't forget to leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel for future videos. But next time, I think we will get started on some of these quests, but for now, uh, my name is Leo, and I'll see you guys next time.